you did um, other science fiction with um, Matt Lucas. Was yeah, you, I did, you, I did, yeah, Claude yeah. Mandu, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that, uh, that would be close to that. Yeah, I don't know what happened with that. I think that, um, <laughs> we're all saying what happened to them. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought it was it was one of those shows that I think was fantastic on the page. It had great pedigree. It had Matt Lucas. It had a really good cast. Um, I was in prosthetics again for this time. Mm. I'm playing a, a bloke who was a half. Um, he was a half man, half pig. I remember Agent Ring said, "I got the perfect job for you." Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so yeah, so and it, it was one of those things, Tal, that on page you look on the paper mm. and you'd go, "Right, okay." It's, it's that was, was hard, yeah, good start, and you know, and the script was witty in that, and I don't know what happened, but somewhere within Comedy Central or the BBC, uh, when it was transmitted, where, whatever it was along the way, it sort of started to change shape and became something that perhaps it wasn't in the beginning. And the thing is, is I still think it's a terrific piece of work. I think that you know, everyone, all of us who were involved in it were proud of it, and I think it's got its following as well. But, um, nice yeah, a bit like... <laughs> and, 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 and also, the pig snout has, has, has done everyone proud in the past, yeah. other than you. Yeah. Well, we had Monkey, remember the... Yeah, Monkey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Monkey, yeah. 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 I mean, I yeah. say that, that's all that comes to mind. But you were posh. Huh? Posh Spice. She got a pig snout? Well, she's done all right, hasn't it? <laughs> Stella. Um, so she's not going to get you any clothes. No, she's not going to be making you any wardrobe. Yeah, I, mean, I think that's the last shirt she'll make for me. Uh, <laughs> so what's new for Stella? So is it going to just carry on and on? Yeah, well, I know we're on now, but we, 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 the second series is being transmitted now. Um, so the third series, uh, I'm writing on the third one now, and it'll be coming out in, um, well, it'll be this time next year again. So basically the second one is now on and then we'll be we're writing the third one now and then we'll shoot the third one next year and then we'll um, we start filming we, we start fil filming it in May and I think it'll be out this time next year basically so and there's a Christmas special coming up as well which I think I'm allowed to say yeah so yeah so that's um, you know and, and that's that's it as far as I know with that but yeah it's good there's all, all the twists and turns and you, you know I mean it's sort of crept up didn't it? I mean obviously there was like 10 episodes or whatever mm. but now it's sort of crept up but I remember going Past um, up in Black Eve, the uh, billboards down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Kind of seeing the girls, and there was your big head, yeah. 50 foot high on a bald billboard. Yeah, I know, I worked up my nose, yeah. And that's when I realised oh, it's actually caught on this. It's caught on, yeah. What's, what's, the, what's the secret of it catching on? I don't, um, it's, it's, I don't I've got my theory, yeah. It's, it's, sort, well, of, I tell it's I'm, sort of gentle. Yeah, I think I think apart from Sky publicity, which is you know that was one of them that you know I had a, I had a nose about six foot big, but I think apart from that, I think that what it is is that it's one of those sort of shows that has values that you can take the whole family to. Mm. So you'll sit down with it and you can sit down and watch it with Nan. You can sit down and watch it with your kids and your teenagers love a gig as well. And and kids seven or eight will enjoy it in in, in a sense. Although the second scene is a bit more raunchy, but you know and and ultimately it's there's a lot of it's about gossip, it's about what makes us tick as well, it's about mm. us wanting to know things about other people that inform what we think about ourselves and um, it sounds serious, like that, but, and, and it's also a romp, it's a comedy as well. Yeah. But I think what is interesting is that it's about the, you know, a lot of people say, and say what happens within that episode, what happens there, I think it's about the minute tie of detail of what happens, which I think, you know, Ruth and David, who created this, are particularly good at is is that it's about the the small things that happen to us, which 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 become uni universal. You know what I mean? So the the, the the you know the parochial becomes universal in a way. They're themes that are common to all of us. You say universal. Um, would it transfer to America? Well, I mean, I don't know what would what would be the small you know a small a small town in the back of I don't know. Um, no. Okay. Well, well, you never know, do you? You don't know, no. You, you never know. know. You don't know. Well, listen, good luck on the next one. Thank you very much. It's been great. Hey, Rollins, lovely to see you again. Thank you, Spears. What about